Hello, prayer partners. Dean Taylor coming to you from our office in Markham, Ontario. Imagine that one month has passed already in 2024. We appreciate you very much joining us in prayer as we seek God's help around the globe where the needs are greatest. Our scripture focus for this month's prayer points is found in Deuteronomy chapter 7 and verse 9. Know therefore that the Lord your God is God. He is the faithful God, keeping his covenant of love to a thousand generations of those who love him and keep his commandments. I pray that God will keep us faithful as we serve him continually. Here is February's prayer points. Pray for Ethiopia. In the face of recent challenges and persistent conflicts in various regions, may our prayers seek divine comfort for those affected. Let's implore God's guidance for the government leaders to pursue solutions that will foster peace, stability, and the overall well-being of the nation. Together, let's uplift Ethiopia for healing, wisdom, and a transformative, positive path forward. Pray for the DR Congo. The ongoing threats of attacks, agricultural crop pests and failures that has led to poverty has caused many to grapple with anxiety, depression, and despair. Pray for God's comfort and presence to shine through the local churches as a beacon of hope. Pray for the pastors and counselors to be empowered by the Holy Spirit to provide compassionate assistance and wisdom. Pray for India. We thank God for the work that He is doing through our programs in India. We are grateful for the bountiful harvests of the farmers in the communities we serve. Let us continue to pray for the overall well-being of these communities, that they may be liberated from the constraints of unfounded beliefs. Please also pray for Efecor, our local partner in India, and their ongoing projects. May our partnership with them continue to flourish and strengthen through our prayers. Let's continue to pray for Kenya. Thank God for the much-needed rains in Kenya following prolonged drought that they have had. Let's join in prayer for abundant crop growth and ensuring sustenance for the farmers and their families. Let us also pray for the churches in Kenya as they play a vital role in supporting the community with our CCT program, that is Church and Community Transformation. Pray for Tanzania. Pray for the restoration of global supply chains and a reduction in inflation. These challenges have placed substantial burdens on the most vulnerable individuals in Tanzania, making it difficult for them to afford even basic necessities. Let's seek God's providence for them and pray that the local churches become a steadfast beacon of hope in their lives. Pray for the guidance for our ongoing impact and innovation uh, conference in Kenya. Several of our staff along with international partners has come together for mutual learning. Our national leaders designed the curriculum to enhance the implementation of church-based community transformation, agriculture, saving groups, humanitarian aid, and creation care methodologies. Please pray for God's guidance and wisdoms to lead this conference and that his presence will indeed be felt by all in attendance. Thanks again for your prayers, and God bless.